Hi guys, this is your reading for the 8th through the 15th. This reading is for Libra. Let's see who this person is that is in your energy this week. Let's see what they're coming with. Who is this person? Scorpio energy. This may have been somebody that has just lost their home. Um, something has happened in their home. But I feel like this more so than anything is a breakup for some of you guys. Um, it was sudden and unexpected of course. <clears throat> but I feel like you know with all endings there are definitely new beginnings on the horizon for you here. Queen of Pentacles. Taurus Virgo Capricorn energy. I feel like even though there's there's been a breakup, a sudden breakup for some of you, a lot of you guys are still looking pretty here. Okay, you still have your shit together. You're still carrying yourselves well. Because I do feel like this Queen of Pentacles is your energy. <clears throat> then we have the world here. I definitely think that um, things are getting ready to turn around for you. So whatever this tower moment is here for you, um, I do feel like even though this is like unexpected, it happened suddenly, I do feel like you were prepared for it though. Um, and you're on your way to achieving whatever it is that you feel like it is that you want and you need and you deserve in your life. This is Scorpio, Taurus, Leo, Aquarius energy here with the world. The world is um, representative, of, representative of you guys going through so many changes, so many e emotional ups and downs and, and, and heels and valleys and hurts. And you, you got all of that under your belt and you're using that um, basically to propel you forward. <clears throat> Look at that. The sun. Happy times are coming for you. Leo energy. Definitely aware of your surroundings and the situation that's going on um, with you guys here. I do feel like whatever whatever's happened here with this tower, you're moving away from that and you're moving away from it swiftly. Um, I do feel like you're holding your head high. This person may have been somebody that was unstable to begin with or either the connection was not as stable as um, you would have liked for it to have been, okay? <clears throat> yeah, see? Three of Swords. But it's in reverse though is the thing so I feel like you know it definitely hurts you but I don't feel like you're holding on to it you're getting up you're dusting yourselves off and you're moving forward Aquarius energy here not Aquarius your energy I'm sorry Libra energy I always say Aquarius with the three of swords so it could definitely be an Aquarius but this is more so your energy of not really holding on to this hurt and ready to move on and move forward because you realize that holding on to it is not doing you any good and then we have the knight of swords here I'm here to tell you you're moving forward you are moving forward I feel but I do feel like um, you know, if if somebody tries to come, this person in particular, I feel like you're ready to um, lash out at them. If they come and try to disturb your peace, it's like you guys are ready to let this person have it. Um, I, I'm getting that you don't want them to feel like they can affect you any more than they already have. It's like I, I, I'm hearing you guys say, let me let me be, you know say less okay <clears throat> three of cups mm -hmm. I see you using your um, excuse me your different familial relationships to get past this situation to help you move on to um, to take your mind off of things engaging with friend, family and friends uh, this is cancer energy here okay 
you are seeing success with this situation currently that you're in aside from this heartbreak this breakup that you guys um, have currently gone through here then you have the five of wands in reverse I'm trying to tell you no more conflict you're falling back to the four of wands happy content happy and content no longer focused on the breakdown of the situation with someone here you're looking forward to brighter days but I do feel like there is someone here that is trying to disturb your peace I feel like this is a strong Aquarius energy um, Leo energy could be cancer as well but um, Strong Aquarius, Cancer, Leo, Scorpio energy for you guys. <clears throat> but I do feel like this person is really trying to um, get back with you or is, is like wanting to talk about what happened between the two of you. Um, basically trying to make you guys like take them back for some of you. Mm-hmm. Let's see what they really want with you. What does this person really want with Libra? What do they really want with Libra? Death. I feel like this person wants to start over again. And I feel that they are basically telling you or wanting to tell you that um, they can change. They want to like bring this relationship out of the ashes because I do feel like for you, it's over. It's dead. Again, Scorpio energy here. Dang, what is up with this? The Knight of Wands, they're here to stay. They're here to stay. The, this Knight of Wands is upside down. You know, I, I think at any moment, if things don't go their way, they can like they can bolt again. But they mean what they say. It's just a matter of if they can stick to it, okay? The hanging man. This person's not going anywhere. They're at your disposal. They're at your disposal. They want you to know that they don't want this relationship to end, that they're not going anywhere, that um, they take responsibility for whatever has happened between the two of you. I see an energy there. And then the hermit. You know, the hanging man and the hermit. Um, they, they almost exhibit the same type of energy. The Hermit is Virgo energy. I do feel like this person is um, kind of like in recluse. I feel that they feel defeated. This person wants this relationship to continue. They are currently looking for answers on how to you know get along with you how to smooth things over with you because right now this person feels really helpless and really hopeless but um, again they want you to know that they're not going anywhere so whether or not they've said this to you mm, quite possibly quite possibly but the hanging man is you know they physically like restrict themselves from doing anything and kind of they they take the standpoint of like you know there's nothing else I can do so they do nothing until they find that 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 spiritual freedom to be able to like um, to get up and move and realize that there are things that they can do but they have to take an introspective view of, of themselves and um, just grow spiritually before they can really make positive moves. So that is a thing with them. With the hanging man and the hermit, this person is, is quite like removed, I feel. They still want you though. Okay? So that's what I have for you and I'll be speaking with you guys soon. Bye.